series. Who are you cheating for? Is hashtag Ultra Champs or hashtag Aura Fire? But Celibo is gonna be the one that using the Hayabusa, Leo Murphy with the Cho, Udo with the Farsha, Yam with the Balmon, Pai with the Khalid. Yeah. And again, Arte Eagles showing really confidence from the early on. They're yeah. moving towards the mid lane. And the top end is already. You took match up again, Yam. Yeah. With the Balmon this time. Fighting against Kera in the Yuzong. This already had Marsa from Belmont. Yes, and actually, um, yep. they really need to play aggressive towards Alter Ego. If not, it's gonna be very useless. Yeah. Pi, they're gonna face Pi in the mid lane. Trust gonna face it in the bottom lane, I mean. And it's gonna be very easy if the Molten side being popped a lot towards. <laughs> He's still pointing forward just to recall. So, that are huge confidence coming from. Him. They are more though. And by taking a lot of damage to the bottom and just one drive into the turret and they got the kill. Doesn't even need fans to come in. Yeah. And they're the one to <laughs> lurking from the buff, but they don't want to comment anything. So, yeah, actually yeah. the molten side play by Thomas is just so good. Pushing away Kali really bad. And plus we know that actually the quick sand guard coming from Kali. It's not really good if they put it nearby the Molten side because Thomas can open the Molten side and try to finish him after he's using the quick sand card. I think this game will be a really different game from Aura. They secure to I think so. They're securing to buff already and they're moving towards the jungle from Alter Ego. Getting a lot of confidence right now, Douglas. Mm -hmm. Alright, Alter Ego just keep <laughs> recalling in front of Aura. But they keep if they keep doing that, actually Alter Ego with the Way of Dragon later, the key player in this match will be coming from Leo Murphy. If Leo Murphy have the moment to do the Way of Dragon and try to pick up the Aura Fire member, it's just going to be very epic for them. Yeah, especially if you can get you, you shouldn't see, but the Dragon coming from Kera, he won't take some Leo Murphy right now. They glad to the city can run behind the turret. Oh no, he's just getting the kill. And Chang A doing a lot of damage also there. The two okay. kill, the first two kill coming from our fire. Yeah, even though I happen to be nerfed, you should still be hyper carry from the team inside of MPL ID season six Indonesia. But yeah, um, I I don't really I don't really see the moment that Gin given a lot by our fire. I mean, like they have a very aggressive hero, but they only use it for killing two member of Team Alter Ego. They're supposed to get more. Yeah. They're supposed to get more. And they are fighting for Turtle right now. These are really weak for weak points from our right. As we mentioned in the early days. They're really weak at fighting Turtle. But oh, they okay. have to be careful. Actually, Celibo is still pretty decent with level 7. It's higher compared to fans. I don't know Ooh. why. But they were me being chased down. Dragon still want to get behind. They don't want to commit anything right now. As they play safely, both of them actually. I don't know why fans. Yeah. Is not Coming forward? even oh. richer compared to Sally Boy. Uh, they are working towards the turtle as the turtle is getting low. Leo Murphy can't get anything right now as he run behind again. At this hour, get the turtle. The yeah. first turtle is here. The first turtle, okay, they got it because of the meteor shower given by uh, Chang. -e. If, if it's not, what will happen? But Sunibo is still richer and also having higher Oh, Or Douglas want to chase Pi, but using his ultimate to run, jumping behind safely. Actually, it's pretty waste from Pi because he's using the sandstorm to jump out of the war. It means yeah. that he's using a very huge resource to play more offensive, to be beaten like that. And it's not really good coming from Team Alter Ego, but still, I don't see the potential here. Uh, Sally Boy, if you thought that he's being harassed, still level 8. Oh my god. Oh, they got one here, but Drake coming from Yuzong is distracting the Alter Ego. And Udil being taken down behind the turrets. And Kira still wants more. Darkness coming forward. But Leo Murphy still can play safely behind the turrets. They don't yeah. want to take any unnecessary risks right now. From yeah. Aura. 3 0. 3-0, but Yuzo is the one that giving the pressure towards Farsha. So Farsha cannot use, really use that one, but Sandstorm being open in the mid lane. Okay. And look at the damage that's been given from Yam towards Chang e right there. And Chang e is down. Yeah, the first kill. From Alter Ego at least. 
Yeah. Actually, yeah. First kill. But look at the, the, the gold difference. It's only 2k, it's not too many friends. And trust in the bottom lane actually leading the laning phase compared to high. That yeah. actually is supposed to stay in the bottom lane. And they are mirroring the move from Aura. They get it to the top turret at least. Yeah. Uh, I don't really get it, but it's six minutes, four kill total. So the action per minute is Turtle not really huge soon. here in this game. The second game is much more passive compared to the first game. Yeah. Oh, with the way of Dragon. Connect to Trash and there's Barmon wanting to follow him up. He has the ultimate, but Trash still has the life till his ultimate is saving him as the ultimate from Parsha. Okay. We fan Aura to play aggressively. Yes. And... Uh, if you can see, actually, the turtles still want to be secured by Team Aura Vire. It's three bar left, and the rest of Team Alter Ego know it. Will they let it happen? Because Leo Murphy now jumping to the front. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Not today, boy. Udil also being chased down till half of the damage from Kira to take him down. And Sally Boy can't do anything at all just to watch his teammates die. And Kali jumping forward, also Toss coming from Jav at Pai, taking a lot of damage, Taco, and also being taken care of by Aura. Three men down right now from Alter Ego as they lose the mid turret. Yes, but the top turret is taken by Balmon in the top lane, by Yam right there. But the third turret right here will be taken easily, I think, by Team when they want to go against. Tamus, Hayabusa is good, but look oh, at that Oh, doing a lot of damage, and Kai wants to jump forward with his ultimate. Doesn't catch anyone, though. Yeah. As but Udil also being chased down, and Leo will be the Drake coming from Kira. Okay. This is really, really annoying, though. Yeah. The Whenever they them. see Black from Dragon, they run away. Yeah. Directly. Because they have no power contesting Yuzhong. Yeah, this Yuzhong is already giving a huge and technical first game. And Pahai getting close behind by the Javed, but no one died yet. And Hayabusa also uses Shadow Kill to survive actually. Oh. And Hayabusa being taken down. This is a disaster from Alter Ego. And Yam getting really low running behind. Still can run behind the Invita Turret and they won't chase any more Aura. Oh, but Leo Move is staying in the ambush. No one checking the ambush. How come they're not checking the ambush? Okay. How come Leo Move is still alive there? They're supposed to punish him really bad. And they want to take over the blue buff from Team Alter Ego and they will got it without any hesitation. But Leo Murphy is still alive. Oh my god. Yeah. They must be regretting that one. They yeah. must be regretting that one. But these are really still a huge advantage for Aura. A yeah. very, very huge one. Yeah. Six, 6k. 6,000 gold advantage and 8-1. Eight, 8-1 one. Eight one kills in 8 minutes actually. Oh my god. Um... But for me, the draft is Turtle the problem. Soon. For me, the draft is still the yeah. problem here. I wish it's not being used like that. He cannot do anything. Especially because the, the skill from Team Aura Fire is just so huge. Such as Meteor Shower, uh, Mountain Shocker, and also the meet, uh, from the... Sorry, the back from Dragon. It's yeah. just creating a lot of chaos. And they know that they're actually getting mm. countered by the Jao Hat. For unstoppable forcing Hayabusa. And again, I think so Tank is really the problem here. We can't do anything like, like now. Especially to pinpoint one target, and I don't think they can get Yishun Sin. He's going too far behind. Yeah, oh. I think. And also the Feather Aspect coming from Udio doesn't do anything at all, just to clear the minions. It's like a 3 versus 5 here, because of what you've mentioned before. It's, uh, uh, Farsha cannot really work because of the Black from Dragon given by Team Aura Fire. Aside of that one, Hayabusa cannot work for this meta, I think. Because you if, cannot do it. If he doesn't stay in the mid lane, maybe he can do it. But he's staying in the mid lane against 4 or 5 heroes, Hayabusa can't do anything. But the if thing he, is... If he's moving the, over the side in the bottom lane, I think he can, he can kill Tamus. Solo kill, maybe. But we need a very, very strong side lane, so I don't think Hayabusa is one of the strong side lanes. Not as I a think. side lane. Yo, no, no, yeah. Big chase the right now, the earth is coming from farm, from farm from here. Want to take the buff and he get it. And Kera again, he chased down the back line, even taking a lot of oh. damage as far. Oh, deal! You have to be careful right now. 
he's still able to use the wings by wings and run away from the situation right there. But if we can see actually Team Aura's plan to go to the Lord, will they be able to get it? Because we know that the war inside of the Lord is not really good for Aura Fire. Okay, this is the very first time I saw Aura manage to get the Lord without any contest from the opponent. Maybe because of the losing opponent right here, but Leo Murphy receiving a lot of damage by the Meteor Shower just now. Yeah, forcing him to take to use Freaker. Yeah. And that's really huge. As the Lord come in, without Freaker from Chow, they don't have any surprise. But yeah, the Lord is coming to the full thing. I think it's gonna be very hard for Alter Ego to manage to handle the food. Thank Kali here! He still can run away as the Baker from Kera jumping behind and the Vader Ice Tactic can defend this, but they're losing Kali still. Yeah. They're losing Khalid here, even though the Khalid is in a very good stance from to stop the movement coming from our of Fire. But it's not going to be happening because of the Black Home Digger that's being open. Oh, especially the Inferno right there! Oh, 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 oh Nice toss. Taking Bowman down. Two yeah. hero strikes now from Alter Ego. Haven't been this found right. And Leo will be taking a lot of them and using his chain is finishing him up. And Sally Boy can't do anything at all. He just run behind and still can survive. But no one can defend this. They want to check Hayabusa. Keep chasing Sally Boy with the Shadow Kill. He's a defensive Shadow Kill. Maybe they can take Thrust down. Thrust has been taken down. And Sally Boy still can't run behind. Okay, but it's for, for Hero. Gonna chase him down. Can yeah. he do the recall? Because the rest of the teammates of Alter Ego is still trying to defend the mid lane here. But Fans and also Darkness is not gonna stop there. The Shiri can still looking for the some life steal. Oh, Look okay. at that one. <laughs> oh, Sally boy. Being okay. skipping Jason and right now, finally he's dead. I don't know why he wants to get close to the rest of the team of Aura Fire. He's supposed to jump to the front, not looking back even a little. But he's still peeping to the back. That's the problem, yeah. I think. They're chasing him. And... Look at the item here. And if you can see, the item coming from Yishun Shin is Blade of Despair. Outlaw's battle along with Finwing. Actually, he's handling the damage that's gonna be given from Hayabusa. Because Hayabusa is only having the half assist plus and lost battle. So I don't think that damage is pretty much huge coming from uh, Hayabusa. But I don't know if he's making try to make over the blade of his face, it's pretty much late now. Oh, oh, oh but he's bottom lane! Oh, Balmon and Kera again doing a lot of damage here. If they want to finish this game right now. The, the toss again from Sally Boy using his Shadow kill to play defensively. He still can run. He still can survive, but there would be the way of taking actually going and knocking fast back and toss again from Zhao back. He soon takes the kill. Yeah, the ejector that being given by oh my god, is it gonna be game number three Ooh, right here? I think so. Five still have the sense song, but he's taking a lot of damage. He can't survive this, and Sally Boy just just do nothing here. Yeah, but the defensive feeder aspect given by OD right here. Just to prevent the movement given from Team Aura. But look at that one. I see little the ejector coming. But Sally Boy jumping to the front right there and get beaten so hard. Yes, the base. Oh my god. Oh my god. Aura actually managed to do a very good job right here.